Nope. Another bullhead. Another bullhead. Another bullhead. That's a good flathead bait right there. Too much. Look at I, I do too. You. That's a face it's only a mother love. Hey guys, Josh here with the Weekend Angler, back with another short tip Saturday video. And guys, this week we're going to be talking about a quick and simple rig that you can use that's going to put more bullheads in your bait tank. So stick around. All right, guys, when I was a kid, we used to go camping every summer out at Crab Orchard Lake. And one of the things that I enjoyed doing was at night, we'd get the rods out, we'd put them in the rod holders, and we'd try to catch a catfish. Unfortunately, Crab Orchard Lake also has a fairly healthy population of bullheads that always saw fit to steal our bait and otherwise mess with our hooks and keep us from getting what we were after. So if you fished any lakes or ponds that have bullheads in it, you probably know what a nuisance they could be. But on the other side of the coin, bullheads make excellent bait for flathead catfish. Bullheads are lively, they're hardy, they stay alive on the hook a lot longer than a bluegill or any type of sunfish would, and they make a whole lot of kick in action and racket while they're down there on the bottom, and that will bring the cats in to investigate, which hopefully ends up with them eating that bullhead and ended up on your hook. So what we're gonna be doing today, I'm gonna to be showing you a rig that's been working great for me over the past week. I hope it works great for you and lets you get some bullheads that you can put in your bait tank and go out and do a magic trick and turn those little bitty bullheads into trophy sized flathead catfish. So let's go ahead and go over to the workbench. I'll show you how easy it is to put this rig together and then you'll be ready to tie it, gear up and go out and catch the bullheads. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at the materials for this easy bullhead rig. You're going to need a barrel swivel, a half ounce casting sinker, a three ounce circle hook, and a dual lock snap. Start off by tying the main line from your rod to one side of the barrel swivel. Now cut a liter of 12 to 17 pound monofilament to a length of around 12 inches. Attach that liter to the three aught circle hook by using a snell knot. Trim your liter to a length of around six to eight inches. Tie your liter to the other side of the barrel swivel using your preferred knot. Be sure to trim the tag end. Now attach the dual lock snap to the main line side of your barrel swivel. And attach a half ounce casting sinker to the other side of the dual lock snap. If necessary, due to wind or current, the sinker weight can be adjusted. Heavy catfishing gear is neither necessary nor beneficial for bullheads. Best results are usually obtained with a medium or light action rod. I would prefer an Ugly Stick GX2 in medium action with a size 40 spinning reel. As you can tell, these guys get angry pretty easily this little bullhead's ready to go out and help me find a flathead. All right, guys, well, there you have it. A quick and simple rig that doesn't take a lot of materials and it's easy to tie. And the hookup ratio on this thing has been phenomenal for me this week. And I hope it's gonna do the same for you. Guys, if this video has helped you out, please take a moment, give it that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, checking me out for the first time, guys, I post a fishing or boating related tip or trick video every week. So if that's something you're interested in, take a moment, hit that subscribe button and the little bell next to it. That way you don't miss a video when it goes live. Guys, get out there, catch the bullheads, bring the kids. The kids love catching those things. They're fun to catch. They work good for flathead bait and they stay alive a whole lot longer on a hook than a bluegill or sunfish. It's a win-win situation. Guys, take care. That's all I've got for this week. 
Until next time, we'll catch you out on the water.